Well, it is day 11 of V-Dog, and I literally just got home from Otakon. I'm, I'm parked in my driveway right now because uh, I can't open my garage with the remote. I can only do it manually. Um, look. Oof. Yeah, you hear that? Oh, wait. That sounds like it's working. Great. Ugh. Yeah, maybe if the guy who um, repairs garage doors but doesn't know what's wrong with mine, even though... Well, I've never been here, though. That's probably another video. So, um... Oh, my badge is in there. But it's time for the traditional Otakon haul vlog. So... Shogokin Great Mazinger. And, uh, well, I'll just pull it out briefly here. I did take a peek on it already. Yeah, like the uh, Mazinger Z, it's got several accessories. One thing it doesn't have is the Rocket Punch exhaust. And now I, f now I know why the uh, Mazinger Z had two sets of Rocket Punch exhausts. The other set was for this guy. And I, I do plan to do a uh, video where um, Z is pulling... Wait, here it is. Where Z is pulling Great's finger, and maybe I'll put the rocket punch exhaust coming out of his butt. And, okay. oh, you said butt. And then, uh, let's see. What should I bring up next? Well. Ooh, this will be good. Sort of. This is some stuff for my nephews for Christmas, so I'm not going to show you that because uh, they might be watching this. It may or may not have something to do with Pokemon. This is the eighth Dr. Sonic screwdriver. Um, actually, the in the actual TV movie, and I'll have to double check this, it was, I think, comp compacted and it popped out. I doubt this does that. We'll find out. And, um, oh yeah, look at this. They also have, I didn't bother to get that one, but there's the fifth Dr. Sonic screwdriver, which it has a white line. That, okay, that's, um, that's too similar, at least for the moment. Here, at least the head is different, and it may be do the pop-up stuff, but probably not. And, um, um uh, I got these at Ollie's. They were much cheaper. It helped me survive the convention. Um, you don't need to know that. Well, I also, they were giving away some free swag here. Let me. Specifically at, Vi at the Viz booth, if you bought something, you would get a free, your choice of tote bag. And well, I'll get to that in a moment. So I did get um, Ronmo One Half DVD Volume 2. Is that rattling around? Might be. Better be careful with it. Yeah. El Walmart, if you would have carried it, I would have bought it at your place, but you didn't. So, well, maybe it actually worked out because that way I could, well, they also threw in this Ronma poster. Yeah, yeah. Anything in the back? Um, oh, two-in-one manga editions. Whatever. I don't really like the translation job they did on it. Suck on that, old man. Really? Um, But anyhow, the tote bag, the reason I like this, the tote bag, um, it's the Sailor Moon tote bag. And I have a friend who likes Sailor Moon, so hopefully you're not going to watch this uh, before I uh, give this to you, Devaney. But, um, yep, also they had Sailor Moon poster, so, and what, what else here? Yeah, Sailor Moon fly, Sailor Moon crystal flyer. And what's this, uh, receipt, and uh, what, heylols.com, well, I won't put that in, take that out of the bag here. And let's see what else. Um, not too much else. I you don't I, you don't want to know. How, I don't want to know how much I spent. Actually, not as much as in some years. No, some I, some years I really don't want to know how much I spent. How long is it? Four and a half minutes. Let me just double check if anything's in the trunk. Yep, I won't even bother uh, wasting time to do the sonic screwdriver gag.
There does not appear to be, but I'm going to wear my PVP fez because fezes are cool. So anyway, here's a grab bag I got from one dealer. I thought of getting grab bags from multiple dealers, but then changed my mind. However, as you can see, it's stapled. I do not know what's in here, so let's find out. Ooh. Ooh, hey. It's a Pikachu um, with a zipper. Can you see the zipper? Right there, zipper. Let's see, there's a description here. Um, Nui Guru, Nuri Gurumi Ryuk. Oh, so it's some kind of, it's a Ryuk. That's a cuddly, oh, here we go. Cuddly rucksack. That's, that's cute. Um, Lupin the Third. It's the voice of Nick Adams. Some of you will get that. There's, of course, uh, Zenigata, who was an originally voiced, well, not not the the pilots, but the, the main, the most longest running Zenigata voice, the canonical one, as it were, was Nayagoro, who was the Toho's go-to voice for dubbing gaijin actors, including Nick Adams and um, Russ Tamblin and whoever the American guy was in Latitude Zero. And let's see, I think there's just one other thing in here. Here we go. Clamp Noki Seki. Oh, wait. Oh, Clamp Chess Set. Yeah. So I got, ah, here we go. Can you see this? I've got a rook, a pawn, a rook, pawn, and knight. Of course, um, there are, you need 16 pieces for chess, so I need, would need 13 other pieces. Well, I'm going to keep this in the plastic wrap. If nothing else, I might have a friend who will like it. But, um, hmm. Maybe I'll give this to my nephews as well a little earlier. Actually, one of them has a birthday near Christmas. Well, we'll see. Um, probably not now because he's probably watching this. And that's nearly seven minutes. So I've got a car to unpack. And I've got lines to at least slightly familiarize myself with because we're doing table work tonight. And, you know, I'm, might want to take a nap. Might want to shave. Uh, we'll see. Emptying the car is the important thing. And then... Um, if you're in Altoona in mid-September, um, come and see us. Um, oop, what's this? Flyer came out. Buy more robots. Yeah, I'm not going to show you the back because that has profanity in it. And Oh, shh.